Hello everyone, my name is Isabella Nord and I am a conservation educator here at the Salado Wildlife Education Center. Today I will be kicking off our woodland habitat series, but first we need to define the word habitat. Basically a habitat is an animal's home, it's where they live, and that home must satisfy four basic needs in order for that animal to survive and reproduce. All animals have four similar basic needs, including humans, and those four basic needs are food, water, shelter, and space. Now what an animal eats is going to depend on what kind of animal we're talking about, the time of year and what's available to them, and it can even depend on the age of that animal. Now the second is water. Animals can get water a couple different ways. They can drink it like we do. They might get it from their food, like grasses or berries. And if you're an amphibian, you might absorb water through your skin. The third basic need is shelter. Animals require protection from weather and their predators. And the last is space. Animals require room to spread out to find all of those resources. So in order to find food, water, and shelter, they need space from each other. So now that we've talked about the four basic needs of all animals, we can talk about the four habitats that you can find here in the state of Kentucky. Those four include grasslands or prairies, wetlands like ponds, streams, lakes, and rivers, the third is caves, which is my favorite. And the last is woodland habitats or woodland forests. You can see right now, we are in a woodland habitat. Forests are made up of lots of trees and then underbrush. In Kentucky, we have a lot of native trees, over 120 to be exact. And my favorite way to remember that is we have 120 counties in Kentucky, so 120 native trees. Now our woodland species, the animals that live in woodland habitats can satisfy all four of their basic needs in our forest. So let's break that down. A squirrel might feast on oak and hickory nuts like this one. This is a hickory nut provided by a hickory tree. A deer might get its water or drink its water from a stream or a river in a forest. A bird like a cardinal might build its nest and take shelter in an oak tree. And lastly, room. So Kentucky is made up of 50% woodland forest. That's 12 and a half million acres. And that sounds like a lot because it is. So as long as we continue to protect our woodland forest, our animals will always have a lot of room to spread out. I wanna thank you all for tuning in today. I hope you learned a lot about habitats and Kentucky's woodland habitats. Make sure you tune in to watch Josh's video about nocturnal woodland species. Have a good day.